Homes in America can be festive on holidays. They are often decked out in spooky decorations for Halloween in October and joyful displays on other holidays like Christmas. This always interested Aisha Suban, a mother of two who immigrated to the U.S. from Afghanistan. Me and my kids get really fascinated by the lights and the inflatables all around the street. So we just keep walking all the winter season in the street every evening. Inspired by what she saw, Suban started making her own decorations, but for fellow Muslims. She now lives in Sacramento, California, where last year she started Era Trend Store. Named partly after her daughter, it offers Muslim team lawn decor. The reason I start this business is for my kids because as I feel their excitement to have the uh, to have these inflatables or the any lights decoration they like, I'm sure like there are other parents too who feel the same for their children but unluckily they cannot do or celebrate as they want. This is why Indonesian-American Muslim Akka Pangastuti Wang wanted to decorate her home in the San Francisco Bay Area with festive Ramadan decorations, some of which Suban designed. We like to decorate the interior of the house too during Ramadan. We have prayers up all around. This gives our children a great experience while they're at home. Her youngest child, Gwen, agrees. I think it's great to embrace and immerse yourself in the holiday. Uh, in our house, we, we decorate it with banners and balloons saying Ramadan or Eid. And I think that's very fun. Muslim cleric Adi Sumandi says there's no religious instruction against lawn decorations and he thinks it's a positive idea. This can be part of proclaiming one's faith. This shows that Ramadan is here, especially for children. Children experience a world of play, a world of fun. So these decorations are more positive than negative. Kids can see Islam as not just doom and gloom, only serious things. But they can see Islam as something enjoyable. Like many immigrant communities, Indonesian Muslims in the U.S. are relatively close and many come together for Ramadan activities like study and prayer. And now, like their non-Muslim neighbors, many can also share their joy and celebrate their faith True festive lawn decorations. Dania Iman, VOA News, Sacramento.